just to let y'all know this is like take three of my intro My channel my name is Zakia if you are new here if you're a returning subscriber hey girl so today as you can see is going to be a what I eat in a day and of course they will be all high protein meals so you guys have some examples I get messages on Instagram and TikTok so I want to do another one so today is going to be a apple cinnamon high protein oatmeal so if you like those desserts that have the warm apples in them that's what we're gonna do today so let's go ahead and get started. What I do is I start off with boiling my almond milk and my cinnamon, my vanilla extract, and my stevia sugar. So usually I do about 60 grams of oats. So I'm usually, I'm gonna do a cup and a half of almond milk. You could use any milk that you like, but if you, I, I feel as though this almond milk any almond milk you really use, but I use this from um, Sam's and it's a cup of this is only 30 calories. Um, I'm eating at maintenance. This is my second week eating at maintenance. And that's pretty much to give my metabolism a break or really to shock it because I've been dieting for over a month. It, I've, I've been told that it's good to diet for um, only four to six weeks and then give yourself a break. So if you don't know that, Maybe that's something you should incorporate, especially if you see maybe a plateau. Um, so this is the cinnamon oats, cinnamon oats. This is the cinnamon powder. So I just usually, I'm very generous with my cinnamon in here. I threw my stevia in there already. And so I'm gonna take my vanilla extract. Just a little bit. And then I'm gonna go ahead and boil this on the stove. All right, so I know y'all saw me fiddling in here. So what I was basically doing was trying to make sure that I didn't find any shells in here. So for anybody who eats oatmeal and they always feel like that, that hard crunch in your oatmeal, that's the shell. So, I don't know about you, but when I taste that, I throw my whole oatmeal away because it just turns me off. Now, I'm gonna go ahead and peel the apple um, so we can go ahead and cook them up in this Smart Balance butter. about to eat this uh, organic uncured turkey bacon a slice of this is 30 calories and six grams of protein so I'm gonna have about three of these so that's 90 calories and 18 grams of protein on top of the protein oats all right now we have our apples cut up I'm only gonna do about half of this because that's way too many apples. Once the butter warms up, I'm gonna go ahead and add the apples and then toss some sugar and some cinnamon in it as well.
so the total for this meal oh that my, the sun is hating all right so for the total for this meal it's 486 calories 30.4 grams of protein 22 grams of fat and 46 0.2 grams of carbs. So that is three turkey bacon slices, protein oats, butter, and then half of an apple. So there you go. Something sweet, especially if you have a sweet tooth, that's perfect for you and it's low in calories. So I'm gonna eat this and then I'm gonna see y'all for lunch. Today I had my little workout, did some cardio. Now we are making the salmon burgers with protein pasta. I have picked up the wild caught shrimp burgers from Whole Foods. This is 22 grams of protein for one burger and then the other half of the protein or just the other protein for the meal is coming from this protein pasta. This is my go-to pasta, Maria Protein Plus. So two ounces of this is 10 grams of protein. Not really as high as I would like it to be, but it does add. I, I don't really care for the calories be that high with the protein that low, but it is what it is. Sixty-eight calories. It is a bit high, but it's 41 grams of protein, 24.5 grams of fat, and 85 grams of carbs. So I'm about to chow down on this, and I'm gonna see y'all for dinner. All right, y'all. So I'm not fully hungry because I did eat like an hour ago. So what I'm gonna do is I got my salmon defrosting. I'm just gonna have a protein drink, and y'all know. Know where my go-to is the fair life so of course we have fair life 150 grams of protein or oh whoa wrong 30 grams of protein 150 calories uh 2.5 grams of fat and four grams of carbs so about to just guzzle this and i'll be back for dinner so we are making honey garlic salmon. And the honey garlic, you'll see how I'm making it. And then I'm actually gonna make, gonna make it with these this mashed cauliflower from Bird's Eye. Um, so what is this? Half a cup is 70 calories. Of course, a full cup is 140 calories. So it's mashed cauliflower. And this is actually good for people who are you know, low calorie, low carb, even keto if you're doing that. So that's what we're gonna make. And this is the sour cream and chive flavor. So I'm gonna go ahead and start this up. And of course, you know, you gotta add your veggies. So we're gonna do some broccoli. 
Um, so let's get started. Today's total calories for dinner is 366 calories. Now that is because of the four and a half ounce of the salmon. And I actually need to double check that, but I'm pretty sure it's four and a half, maybe five, but most likely four and a half. Um, 22.9 grams of fat and 11 grams of carbs. So total today, I met my protein. I met my calories and calories is 1770. Uh, protein is 130 grams and I actually did 131 grams so there you can see all three meals i met my whole entire protein for the day um you know just make sure your protein you have it for every meal if you need to add in a protein shake go ahead and do that but it's not hard you just have to plan out your meals you can't just guess what you're going to eat for the day because then you're not going to hit your calorie goal and you're not going to hit your protein goal and for you for those of you who are actually counting your macros you may not even hit your macro goals either so I hope you guys enjoyed that. I hope you guys uh, want to see more of those because I do like making those. Let me know in the comments what you would like to see me make um, or any suggestions on what you would like me to do. I do. I did go ahead and post a full body workout. No equipment needed. So go ahead and check that out on the screen here. And I will see you in the next one. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel, y'all, and like this video. I would really appreciate it. See you in the next one.